Hey everybody, it's Video Game Restoration, and today I'm going to show you how to put in Retro 6's Clean Juice Rechargeable Battery Pack for the Game Boy Advance. This is honestly one of the simplest mods you can do. We're going to start by removing the tabs that hold the AA batteries in. I prefer to use these cutters here, but you can use flush cutters, a Dremel, a knife. Just be careful and don't hurt yourself for the love of God. This can easily be done without disassembling the Game Boy. However, this one was getting an IPS screen, so I did it while it was all disassembled. If you're doing it assembled, just be careful that you don't accidentally cut the battery terminals. With the tabs cut out, we're going to put the battery in. Now, you don't have to use this double-sided tape. However, my theory is it's already here, so you might as well use it. Insert the rechargeable battery so that the wire is to the top left of the housing. The battery slides underneath the left-sided terminals and then snugs right down. Expose the double-sided tape if you want to. And then insert the board. Now you can do it a couple ways. You can either plug it in and then put the board on, or you could put the board on and then plug it in. It's whatever your preference is. I find it a little easier to do it while it's out. Ensure that the board terminals are in contact with the Game Boy's terminals. With those both pushed in, I'm going to get my battery door that has a USB-C cutout. This door should easily fit on. If it doesn't, you might have to take everything out and ensure that the tabs are cut down enough. But once it's on, you're done. That's it. Just plug it in to ensure that you get a blue light here to charge. It will turn green when it's fully charged, and then power on the system to ensure that's working. Perfect. Now, if you like this video or you found it helpful, please consider liking and subscribing. And if you want to see a tutorial on how to do something else, please leave a comment. Other than that, have a good day and let's save the consoles.